Okay, I'm going to show you how to make a ROM hack on Lunar Magic with the emulator. Well, that's the emulator, and that's Lunar Magic. That's the file you're going to need, and I'm going to show you guys where I got it and how I make ROM hacks. You're going to want to go to Mediafire. Mediafire is one word, and then you want to search that, and then put in Super Mario World at the end, okay? So I'm going to do that. And if you don't put it as one word, which I just did, you won't get any suggest, you won't, you won't get any search results. So you want to search Mediafire, Super Mario World. Hang on. And it's not the special zip, because I played that game, it is hard as hell. The first level, holy fucking shit, has no mushrooms in it. Um, no, that's not it. Hang on. You know what? Fuck it. What you could do is you could just go to the special zip, and then over here it'll say, like, your download shit is starting, and then all you have to do is save it, and then once you save that, you can X that up into Internet Explorer, open up your documents, and then you just have to scroll down in your documents till you find it, which I have the file that you need right here, Super Mario World U! Exclamation point. But this is a file that you would down you guys would have downloaded if you were to follow this. So since it's on here, not in like a file bin, what you can do is you can right click and what you need to do is extract all. You click on extract all and then you go to extract. You wait for a minute and then you get something that looks like this. And that's the file you're gonna need, which I have right there for the original Super Mario World that's untouched. So, what you're going to want to do is click and drag this to your desktop, which I'm going to do right now so there's nothing special I'm doing. All I did... Oh, wait, no. That's the file, because it says you can replace it. That's the file... Hang on, let me just tell you this. This file right there is the same exact thing as what I just downloaded. Well, I didn't download... I didn't download it because I already downloaded it and I don't want two of the files on my computer. So on and so forth. So X out of all of that, and then what you're going to want to do is go back to the Internet Explorer. This is where you get Lunar Magic, okay? What you want to do is go to Super Mario World, so just type in SMW Central. Super Mario World Central. Enter key. It'll be the first thing. It says Super Mario World Central Main. What you want to do is go and click on that, double click on that. And then what you're going to want to do is on the left hand side, there will be all these question mark blocks rotating. You want to scroll down to where it says Tools, as you can see at the bottom. You want to click on that because that's where you're going to get the Lunar Magic Tools. Right there. Click on Tools. Double click on that actually. And then what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna have all these tools, you're gonna have like a thousand of them. So what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to scroll down until you find something called It's right here. Lunar Magic V one point six five. It's that far down, or my bad, that far down there's the cursor thing that moves up and down. It's pretty far, it's not that far down there, but Lunar Magic V1.65, it's right there. You want to, if you want to look at it, it's got 577.9 kilobytes. What you're going to want to do is you want to click on download. 
when you do that, it's going to pop up this thing. If you have a Dell Inspiron, well, you don't need an Inspiron. If you have a Dell, this will help you tremendously because you might be able to, you probably would have seen this before. If you're downloading something, all you have to do is save it, and then you'll find like LM165. And I have it right there, too, because I've already downloaded this because you saw it on my desktop. So what you're going to want to do is save, and I'm just going to click, click cancel because I already have it and don't want two files. But you guys want to click the download button, obviously. And what you're going to want to do is, I don't care. Hang on. What you're going to want to do is go back to your documents now. And then find, uh, you want to scroll down in your documents. To the, well, I already extracted it, so you're going to find this. LM165, if you click on it, it'll, like, stop responding for some gay reason. Right-click, extract all, right there. And then you just extract, and then you'll get, if you click on extract, you'll get a folder that looks like this. And I'll show you guys, because I will extract it. Well, this is about Lunar Magic, and I don't want it to copy it, but this is what you get. You get Lunar Magic with a question mark, Lunar Magic with a kudos moon, and read me. You want to take the one that says Application, the second one down, with the kudos moon. It says Lunar Magic, the second one. Take that, drag it to your desktop, and that is what I got. That's what I got. So let me exit out of this stuff. So, you got Luna Magic, and now you got the file you need. And now, all that's left is the emulator to play it in. And that will be in part two, because we're at seven minutes and my camera's about to die. So, see you guys later. Part two will be how to get the emulator. See you guys later.